「おれたおあいすばさ」「きみはすこしあおすぎるそらにすかれただけさ」「もうだれかのためじゃなくてじぶんのためにわらったいいよ」Hello everyone, this is DT Ninja831 here to bring you、uh, volume 2 of Nihon no Kotoba, Words of Japan. Okay, guys, this week,、um, this is a little late,、uh, but this is、uh, volume 2, so you can take it、uh, however you want it. But、um, here's volume 2, so, okay, this week、um, we're going to be focusing on Bleach. Volume 32, The Howling. Yes, Grimgel versus Ichigo. I'm gonna teach you some Japanese words、uh, that are used in this epic volume. This week, I'm gonna teach you five new words, okay? Five new words. And then at the end, I'm gonna teach you two expressions that are used commonly in the Japanese language. And they are used in this volume against、uh, Grimjow and Ichigo are fighting. So, yes, let's get to the greatness here, okay?、Um, so, first off, we're going to learn、uh, the word help, help, okay? So, this word uh, looks uh, basically, this word is tasukete, taskete, okay? Taskete means help. So, check this out. Okay, so we, we pronounce it tasukete, taskete, okay? That means to help, help me, help me, okay? Or you help someone. Taskete. Uh, means help me, okay, or help, help, okay. So、uh, basically,、uh, when you use this,、uh, it means you're helping someone or you're asking someone to help you, okay. So let's go to the、uh, manga, okay, volume 32, The Howling, and we will see、uh, Ichigo. Obviously, he says that in a way, okay, Orihime,、uh, he has come to Waco Mundo. To rescue her, okay, or help her, okay, so let's check out、uh, the manga, okay, alright, so the beginning, okay, so let's go to the manga, okay, so here is obviously the fight between g r i m j a o and Ichigo, and g r i m j a o basically is furious at Ichigo, he's well, basically saying, You don't want to kill me? What, what are you? You're like, You're a soul reaper. I'm a Shinigami. It's, it's second nature. Okay, so right here it says, Enoe o, Enoe o, Taskete, or Taskeru, okay, Taskeru, and then it says, Tame da, okay, Tame da, and So, taskete obviously means help, right? Taskete. I came to help her. I came to rescue her. Okay? So, rescue or help means taskete. Okay? Taskete. Okay, now let's、um, see.、Uh, basically, taskete can be used when you need help or you're helping someone else. Okay? So, that's how it's used in the manga when g r i m j a o and Ichigo are fighting. Okay? Alright, l so the next one we're gonna look at. The next one we're gonna look at is. The next one we're gonna look at is. End. End or finish, okay? So obviously in Bleach there's a lot of fights, right? So we have a beginning and an end, okay? So you will hear this word so many times. o w a d i d a o w a d i d a Okay, now check this out. Okay, so, o w a d i d a means、uh, it's over. Let's finish this.、Uh, it's the end, okay? o w a d i d a Even when, you know, like you hear Madara or Itachi say, o w a d i d a you know, Sukiyomi,、uh, it's over. This is the end, okay? So, it's been used so many times in anime manga, okay? So, I have a very, very interesting.、Uh, 
part in, in the manga here where Ichigo states that he will end it in an instant. Okay, so let's go to the manga, okay? Alright, so Ichigo has the mask on, okay? The visor mask on. And this is Inoue, obviously, seeing it for the first time. And she's reminded of her brother, right? Of her brother as the hollow. And then it goes here, okay? And she is really worried about Ichigo, right? And then, what does Ichigo say? He says, Suko ni. Sugo ni, which means quickly, and here he says, Awara seru kara. Okay, Awara seru kara, which means, I'll end this quickly. I'll end this quickly. This won't take long. Okay, so basically he says he'll end this quickly. Okay, so that is one instance where it is used in this awesome fight. Okay, let's get to another instance because obviously it is used for fighting as well, not just speaking. Okay, here's the other instance. Grim Jow has finally shown his true powers. Okay, and he's going after Ichigo. Okay. So right here, where he's got the crazy face, he says, Owari da, Owari da, Kurosaki, right? Owari da. It means it's over. It's over. Okay? It's the end. Okay? Finished. Over. Okay? It's over, Ichigo. All right. So let's get on to the next word, okay? The next word for this week has to be okay lose lose because in a battle okay we win and lose so these are essential lose lose means makeru 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 okay now look at this kanji Okay, so now let's take a look in the manga where Makeru is used, okay? Because it is used um, many times and you may not know it, okay? Alright, so let's go right into the manga, okay? Right where a pretty, um, a pretty epic moment where they're fighting, you know, Ichigo and Grimjow are fighting and all of a sudden Grimjow says, you don't want to kill me? What's wrong with you? You know, this has been going on for a thousand years, you know, Shinigami and, Hol and uh, Hollows have been fighting for a thousand years, okay? Uh, the, the losers will be annihilated, okay? Now, maketa, maketa, losers, okay? Maketa. Okay, this is losers. Okay, maketa, lost or loser. Okay, lose. Okay, maketa, maketa. Okay, he says the losers will be annihilated. The loser, uh, as in the one who loses. Okay, the loser will be annihilated. Okay, and Ichigo's like, whoa, what, what? He's just learning this. So he's learning the thousand years ago that Shinigami and Hollows were were enemies. So interesting. Okay, all right. So that's how it's used in the manga. So I hope you guys uh, understand better. All right, now let's look at the opposite of makeru, which is win. Win. Okay. Lose is makeru. Win is cuts. Okay. Okay. Now this one is very simple. Okay. Um, basically, it just sounds like it, it is spelled. Okay. Cuts. Okay, there it's C A T S U. Cuts. Okay, it's not katsu. Uh, the su is uh, silent. Okay, so take a look at this pronunciation. Okay, so when is cuts? Okay, so like kata would mean I won. Okay, or okay. So and obviously Ichigo and Grimjow have both stated this word. So we're gonna take a look at how it is used in this awesome volume. Okay, so first let's take a look at Grimjow. Okay, as he's fighting Ichigo. Okay, here we go. He's fighting. Okay. And what does he say here? He says, Kona monde. 
And then he says, Kata sumori ka? And like he has his teeth grinning, you know, he's, he's bleeding from the teeth. And basically what this means is, you think you've won? You think you've won? Okay, so this is where he says win, okay? You think you've won? You think it's over? Basically is what he's saying, okay? All right, now, let's get to uh, the next one. So obviously, makeru is lose, and kats or kata is win, okay? So the next one is, what do you think? We have help. We have the end or finish over, and then we have win and lose, so we have to have die. Yes, die. Okay, die. Now, in this volume, uh, you got Inoue using it, okay? And it's memorable because it's what drives Ichigo to go that extra mile, okay? So let's take a look at that moment, okay? All right. Okay, so you have uh, Inoue here, okay? She is yelling to Ichigo. She says, Shinanaide, okay? Shinanaide, which means don't die, Ichigo. Don't die, Ichigo. Okay? So, don't die, Kurosaki. Don't die. Okay? So, die is here. It is shin. Shin da is die. Okay? Shin da is die. Shin na nai de. Don't die. Okay? So, obviously, here it is used in a negative, but it works the same way and it is the most memorable one in this fight so yeah definitely uh, this one is memorable so don't die shin na nai de don't die so shin da is die okay shin da is die now that we've learned all five let's review them again okay so first we have help help okay help is taskete taskete Okay, next we have end or it's over. It means owari da, owari da. Okay, owari da. And then we have lose, lose. Okay, lose in a battle. Makeru, makeru. Then we have win, the opposite is cuts, cuts, okay? And we have, what's next? Oh yes, we have shinda, which is die, shinda. Shinda means die, okay? All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed. I have two uh, phrases to teach you uh, from this manga, so they're at the very beginning. Let's start with the first one, okay? All right, so Ichigo arrives and sees Inoue here, right? And he says, Shinpai sunna, Shinpai sunna, Shinpai, Shinpai shinai de means don't worry. Shinpai shinai de means don't worry, okay? And the last one is where in a way states to Nell, okay? Nell is worried here. She says daijobu, daijobu, dakara daijobu, which means it's going to be okay, okay? It's okay. So those are our two, those are our two uh, phrases for this week. Okay, so the first one, don't worry. The second one, daijobu, which is, it's okay, it's all right. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed uh, volume two of, you know, uh, Nihon, no, Nihon no Kotoba. Uh, anyways, have a great day as always.